seven under today, great round. Just talk to me about what went what went well out there. Yeah, we both we both putted well. Foxy pretty much made everything, and I made a nice bomb. Well, he also made a bomb. But um, yeah, it was it's such a tough format, and I feel like today we finally uh, got a, a nice rhythm going. Yeah, G was right. It's such a hard format to get a rhythm on. You kind of feel like you don't hit you don't hit a full shot for a while, and then you've got to go out and hit a really hard shot in the wind. And I think we both struggled with that a little bit on Friday and figured it out today, and it was nice to see a few putts go in. We both hold a really long one, which is always nice in this format. And, um, yeah, it was nice to go go forward on a Sunday. It's probably going to be a couple short, but, um, yeah, we would have definitely taken seven under to start the day. Yeah. You guys had a great start with two birdies. How great was it to get off to that type of start this morning? Yeah, because we started off pretty bad on Friday. So, um, yeah, it felt like a completely different start versus then. So, um, yeah, anytime you can get off to a good start, it helps. So, um, yeah, we, we weren't complaining about a birdie birdie start. <laughs> yeah, I don't need to add to that. It was, it was great compared to being two over three three instead of two under three three today. Was, uh, it was really nice. Especially par fives are usually our thing, so bogeying a par five on Friday was not a good feeling. No, that was my fault. Too. <laughs> no. <laughs> great recovery today, but I overheard you guys saying it was a great time, fun weekend. Yeah. Just recap on that, what was most memorable out there? Yeah, I think just between both of us and our caddies, we just had such a good time. Um, we have a lot in common, so um, yeah, whether we were going to play good or not, we were going to have a good time regardless. Yeah, I mean, we've I've got a South African caddy, and Garrick's got a New Zealand caddy, so there's a little bit of banter going back and yeah. forth. There was a scoreboard being held for a while of who who got someone the best and a, and a little bit of chirping. So yes. we had a lot of fun, a few rugby chirps going on as well, which I'll, the New Zealanders were on the receiving end of. But it was <laughs> it's cool to play something like this. You know, you, We get a lot of 72-hole individual stroke play events, and it's nice to play with someone. It, it adds to... It just adds to it. You feel under more pressure. You don't want to let your your teammate down. And um, yeah, it was nice that we could actually both play well. But um, yeah, it, it was just nice to have someone to kind of root for as well on the golf course. We had yeah. a lot of fun, and yeah, hopefully we can do it again next year. Yeah, yeah, we should see us here next year if nothing changes. <laughs> And you guys have a couple more groups out there, but no matter what happens this afternoon, just what does this do for you individually going forward? Yeah, I think obviously Foxy's been playing well for a while now. I think this helps me for sure. I've been struggling with my wrist and not playing great. So this is certainly a step in the right direction. Yeah, same. I've played well the last couple of years, but it's been a bit of a struggle the start of this year. And um, I felt like I turned a corner at the Masters. I, I started at some good shots and that carried over into this week and um, I felt like I had some really good shots coming down the stretch today when I n- maybe not have a chance to win but felt like we had a chance for a really good finish and hit some yeah. good shots and that just helps build the confidence and hopefully we can both take it into next week. Yeah. Any, any final remarks you'd like to say to your fellow teammate? No, it was just a fun week. Yeah, fun week. Let's do it again. Yeah, we will. Awesome. Thanks, Foxy. Thanks, Thanks, thank you. So